Women of Reddit. What is the grossest thing a man has said to you? I was writing up a menu on a blackboard at a cafe. A regular said, Great. That's where you belong. On your knees. Wish I had have snapped back but I was too shocked to reply to his fucked remark. That's not a problem, after they hit on me and I told them I was only 13. After me and my friend refused drinks from him and didn't let him sit at our table. He said, I hope we get into war so women like you get raped. Said to a younger me. A skinny little tween in my junior school uniform standing awkwardly nearby at the bus top. You know what you need. A good meal. And lots of sex. Toss that kid away. I'll give you a new one. From a middle-aged man in a convertible. When I was biking with my then one yo. You can earn my respect back through your sexual penance. At work. A new hire looked at my shoes and stated, Those shoes are why women get raped. The shoes in question were platform wedge sandals. And I was the HR admin running his new hire orientation. Edit since this garnered a lot of questions. This was around 2000-2001. For basic context, I immediately notified my boss. And we tried to stop his employment from moving forward. But he remained in place for about a year. If I recall correctly. It was. Unfortunately. A company that was owned and managed by a Cuban family where some more old school attitudes were. Still maintained. My boss was distant family in the company as well. He did mean well. But could only get so far. I was out with my GF at a club. We were dancing with some other people. She had on a nice dress that fell to a hand width above the knee. This guy came up behind her. And shoved his hand up her dress so high and aggressively that he pushed her underwear up into a wedgie. She obviously jerked away and her first reaction was to ask, Why did you do that? Quote. He just smirked and leaned down to her ear and said, Because I can. So chilling. No apology. No bluster. No attempt at flirting. Just a pure cold power play. My GF used to work in a prison. She got him in a hold. But he was way bigger than her. At this point I still had no idea what had happened but she clearly wanted him out so I grabbed him. By the collar and together we marched him to security. The staff were great. He didn't deny what he'd done and they got a picture of his ID and then kicked him out immediately. They asked if she wanted to press charges and pull the security footage. Which she declined at the time but now wishes she'd gone forward with it. We left about an hour later as the mood had understandably soured. And security warned us that he was still marching up and down the street. Presumably waiting for us to come out. We were staying in a hotel literally round the corner and they walked us to the door and warned the hotel staff about him. His smug face though. When he said that, I assaulted you because I can, fucking terrifying. Girls like you get raped said to me and cousin when we were 11 and 15 years old. We were playing with a huge chess set in the town square and he was watching us. He had been sitting mumbling and staring before this loud declaration. We called my dad to come get us after he continued talking loudly about us to himself. According to my dad he was harmless but not mentally well. I was about 23. I'm 4 feet 11 about 120 pounds. I was a lead at a small building. But corporate. Retail store. An electrician came in and my store leader paged me to let him into the electrical room in the back. It's a fairly small room. That's kept locked. I unlock the door with my keys and let him into the room and he turns to me and says, they should. Never have sent a little one like you back here with me. I could have my way with you and you couldn't do anything about it. Quote. 
It scared me to death and I essentially ran out and found my manager. Who honestly was a dick. But for totally non-sexual reasons. And he apologized to me sincerely that the man spoke to me like that. My manager was rather aggressive for the rest of the time he was there. Didn't say anything to him outright about what he said but he definitely made the guy aware that he knew he was a piece of shit. It seriously scared me so much. He was perfectly respectable looking and said it in like a matter of fact but serious way. Like a warning. I wish I was the one who raped you when you were 15. I had been dating a guy for a few weeks and out of the blue he said that he wasn't actually attracted to me so he didn't want to date me anymore but he wanted to keep fucking me. Oh but he wouldn't be using condoms. I'm a natural redhead. Long auburn hair with curls that I've always had unwanted attention for. I remember I was nine years old and sitting in a Chinese restaurant with my family when a male middle Aged waiter came to take our food and started complimenting my hair which was fine and all but he started touching it and massaging my scalp and shoulders saying how I was so beautiful. This didn't seem to weird out my parents but it made me very uncomfortable but I didn't say anything because I was scared in case my parents would tell me that I was being rude. Probably not the grossest thing on this list but the fact it was done to a nine-year-old little girl makes it downright creepy.